to pineapple or not to pineapple? That is the question. This saucy, cheesy, round goodness sits before me. It begs me not to top it with the forbidden yellow fruit as I watch it with horrified confliction. My mouth yearning to have that delicious combination inside it, while all of civilized mankind screams against this dreadful option. Do I succumb to my dastardly desires? The quandary I face is my life's nadir, with me pathetically searching the stars for an answer. If I were to take the bait and turn this meal from yellow to yellower, I have a terrific feast and sleep satisfied, but all my neighbors, friends, family members, even God himself chastise me. I may choose not to spice up my food, but then I go to sleep depressed, knowing I've given in to absurd social norms. How does one deal with such a delectable disarray of dissonant dilemmas? All one will, all one can do, is give in to their innermost needs. My hand glides over the topping's bowl and grabs a ring of the yellow devil. I bring it over the large circle of red, attempting to drop it in, when my other heroic hand stops me. Every cell in my body is locked in endless, decisive, mortal combat with itself, knowing that this may be my last chance at redemption. The angel and the demon inside me are both fighting, only I don't know which is the angel and which is the demon. In the end, however, the winner had proved to have been predicted, even decided from the start, for I must consume my pineapple pizza.